What's up, YouTubies? This is Corzy from Gaming Legit bringing you a special, special, special. Did I say special? It's a special video because I'm playing with my fiance Miranda. I'm on top. Yeah, she's a, she's on the top screen. She wanted me to say that so you guys don't get confused, so you guys can pay attention to her gameplay. <laughs> I mean, she she never plays this game with me anymore. We used to play quite regularly when we were first dating back before oh. COD 6 wasn't out and COD 4 is kind of old, so Halo 3 was like the main dealio um, and so we used to play this but she never really got amazing scores you get like three kills was still like more than you could ask for it's already more than you could ask for to have a uh, someone you're in a relationship with your girlfriend you know let alone your fiance that's that plays you know halo with your games with you on the weekends this is crazy what do you want to say about this game? What was your overall experience of the online after taking such a big rest from Halo? <laughs> How long has it been since I played? I don't know. I think it was, I mean, <laughs> maybe I'm overdoing it by saying like eight months, but it was no, definitely I, I a long so. period of time. Because it was way back when you used to play. And I haven't played in forever. I haven't even touched like any games in forever. So. Yeah, don't criticize too much. It's been a long time. And I was proud of this game because I actually got more than three counts. <laughs> yeah, I mean, not a uh, bit of a spoiler, I guess, um, but maybe to keep you guys watching this video, she got eight kills this game. And that's just like, that's crazy. That's wild to me. I mean, please leave comments to, and uh, let me know if you guys had girlfriends or, you know, even like just girls that you know that are friends or whatever sure and let you know leave comments saying you know whether or not they've ever played a game if they are like how do they do in this game I don't know it astounds me that she managed to get eight kills because I mean she's playing with people that play this game like regularly and like mm -hmm. she got eight kills from them like that's wild that's totally crazy to me it's I'm crazy sure. to me that she's be able to she can control the um, the reticule what just happened I don't know. Was that where they spawned behind us? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Sorry, what were you saying? <laughs> I was just talking about how it amazed me that you're, I don't know, because I didn't watch your screen while I was playing, and, you know, we took such a large um, retreat from this game or just from playing together, and then, you know, because we play, like, socially together quite often, or we used to quite a bit, right? Um, a little bit. I'm more, um, with my spare time, I like to do artsy stuff. But every once in a while, I would play. Um, I enjoy it from time to time. I get so frustrated, though. Because I already don't get a lot of kills, and then when connection gets crappy, then I really get pissed. Because I'm already at a disadvantage. I don't need any more. But yeah, um, she's probably fiercer than I am when I play <laughs> online. No, I'm not. <laughs> and I get pissed when I get on or when I play online. I don't get pissed at people I play with really. I just get pissed at like, you know, Xbox Live like connection stuff. That's like part of the reason why I probably um put down COD 6 is just fighting connection. So it, it just I don't know. It peeves me off. Um I don't know if you guys have paid attention to this, but oh, Aww. she fell right there. <laughs> so mad about that. I remember right there she was like Baby, <laughs> it's like babe. So I've been paying attention to where I'm at the whole time, and I just got careless and stupid. And the whole time I've been watching people fall off and just laughing at them, and then I do it, and I felt like a retard. Yeah, like what I was saying before, like you know, if you watch her screen and watch her like throw grenades, remember she's on the top screen. Like without me telling her, I don't know if it's from you just like watching my screen or whatever. But you like actually throw nades how nades are supposed to be thrown. Like, if you're going to throw them over a distance or to someone, you do that, like, that pump where you, like, pump up, throw a nade, and then look back down. Where, where, how'd you learn that? I don't remember ever teaching you that. Um, I think just from watching you. No, I think you did comment on it when we first started playing. You were like, what are you doing? And I threw a grenade just randomly somewhere, but... 
I don't know. I think I just picked it up from watching you or just watching videos. I, it kind of makes sense if you're going to throw something. I don't know. I'm not really sure. I think it's I weird did. that, like, we don't take in consideration that it, like, if someone doesn't play um, Xbox or any other console game that involves, like, two analog sticks, how difficult it is for them to, like, figure out um, moving around and aiming and just trying to get that game sense that comes naturally to a lot of guys because we play the game so much. And so, like, for you especially, I don't know. Like, I'm still kind of, like, dumbfounded by, like, how well you're able to move around. Like, it, you look as if, like, you're a normal, like, social uh, Halo player. Like, I don't know. It's not how I started off, though. I remember the first time I played, I was all over the place. Uh, but, I don't know. I really think it's from watching you sometimes. I just kind of pick it up. Or maybe it's better that I had a big break in between and I didn't get so worried or frustrated about just the little things and I just... I think this game I'm more concentrated on just getting out there and trying to get some kills rather than playing it safe the whole time. But, yeah. I don't know. I just... Maybe I didn't worry about it as much since it's been so long. Yeah. Well, I think it helps too that like we sit down and we, you know, go into something and looking at it like oh, this is going to be fun playing, you know, mm -hmm. a, a new, like, social match that, you know, Bungie put in, puts in on the weekends for people just to get together and just, you know, goof around, just have a fun gaming environment that you don't have to take too overly serious. <laughs> That's where I saw the laser and I was like, okay, back up. <laughs> yeah. But then I'm, you got it. It. I like that you, like, you move around, like, kind of uh, wisely somewhat in that like you notice things in the map and you're like uh oh and you like react <laughs> to it yeah i also i used to play a lot and i'd be standing still and i remember that's one thing you told me not to do to always be moving around in this game i think i did way better because i used to just sit and stand there like if i went up to a point like this i'd just stand there and look and try to aim at someone but i've tried to I've tried to remember to always keep moving, especially when you have people sniping all the time and stuff too. It's really important to remember. All right, guys, there's a tip from Corzy's fiance right there. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> Take yeah. that one to the game. <laughs> Put that in as your Halo 3 tactic. <laughs> it's important, especially for new people trying it out. You don't always think about those kind of things. At least I didn't. Well, guys, the game's coming to an end. Um, I'm going to ask you guys to please comment and uh, send me some messages. Uh, rate the videos for sure, but leave comments saying whether or not um, you have girlfriends or past girlfriends or just girls that are friends of yours um, that have ever played this game and how well they do. Tell them to play. That's right. Subscribe, rate. You know the routine. Talk to you guys later. Peace.